Kristen's husband, Tim, returned from a 10-day hiking expedition in Olympic National Park, searching for a remote waterfall that hasn't been discovered in 90 years. He was disappointed to learn that Jenna had already visited and left Quilcene when he returned. Yep. Out here at my sister and Tim's house, and they basically have their own apple orchard on their property. All right, so Kristen's gonna do the dirty work while I stand here and watch. He comes in hot all the time. I might. Traveling full-time presents many challenges, such as not having a home address to ship items to. Luckily, we were able to ship stuff to Kristen and Tim's, knowing we would be in Washington. While the girls and Tim picked apples, I replaced broken glass panes and resealed cabinets in our camper. I then upgraded the transmission cooler on our truck, adding an inline filter and replacing the transmission fluid. I was finally able to clean up the electrical wiring for our LED lights, and then after that, with some help from Tim, I checked all the bearings and brakes on our camper. I cleaned the hubs and re-greased everything. Somewhere in between all this, Tim and I were able to escape at low tide for steelhead salmon fishing. <laughs> the local method of flossing for salmon is very difficult to perfect. Only two barbless hooks may be used and your weight cannot hang below your hooks. Once the five-year-old salmon commit to going upstream to spawn and die, they do not eat, meaning you have to hook them in the mouth or gill plate to legally harvest your catch. You may only keep four salmon per day. Steelhead salmon. Look how pink it is. Red. It's gonna be good. Stasha is working on dinner tonight. Her famous butter and brown sugar, right? White sugar? Yeah, straight up sugar. And it's Tim Helms recipe. Tim Helms recipe? So you yep. score the salmon. Score the salmon like which so. Is the most disheartening part for me. <laughs> Add butter, make a concoction of equal parts sugar and equal parts any type of seasoning you want. Yeah. Looks good. Cook it low and slow. We're going to do it over charcoal, right? Yep. It's going to be good. <laughs> Getting hungry. Yeah. Slow down. Yeah, but it make it Solid it's, it's enjoyable. Sometimes, I like do the George whistle. See, it's much more tenderized now. Now it's going to be a fall off the bone pulled pork. Is there a bone in there? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> But it'll pull much, much more easily. Right. So I'll tell you, that's the main thing you gotta do. Now, we're gonna use salt, pepper, and a little bit of garlic. And we're gonna rub it down with olive oil to do like a pre-night baste. And then we'll finish it with the other seasonings in the morning before we smoke it. It's gonna be really good. Oh. Tell me what you like most about being on the road. If you had to pick one, only one thing that you liked the most. 
every day is different. Like we sense new opportunities. As wherever we are, we may get to do something that we can only do there. So I think that's what I like the most. Yeah. Yeah. What about you? Yeah. I like that too. I like that after work every day we get to do whatever we want. Explore whatever area we're in. Yeah. Go out on the water if we want to. Go fishing, find mushrooms, hiking. You know, rather than like, remember when we used to just binge watch TV at home? Yeah. Or we'd have to mow our lawn after work. That sucked. Yeah. Or you'd be like, oh, our house needs deep clean. We need to clean. So we'd have to clean a mansion. <laughs> but it's now. Not that big. Yeah, but now we get to be free. Yeah. Still got maintenance things to do. That's what we've been doing the last couple weeks. No matter what we live in, we'd have to do maintenance. Even sailing Suliani's, the boat, the sailing people that we follow who live, they live on a sailboat full time. Highly suggest you watch them. Sailing Suliani's. Even they have to deal with maintenance on the boat, but they have to go under and like get the barnacles off their hull. Yeah. That's not for me. <laughs> I'd rather do this kind of maintenance. Bed maintenance? Bed maintenance. Finally got the chance to do the smoker. We got some chicken thighs and we're gonna do some pulled pork on some charcoal. Oh yeah. Got some Sam's cola on that pulled pork with some rub. Now for the thighs. Alright, we got everything loaded up. Just stirred up the charcoal and let it sit for about two hours. Tim and Kristen are in the process of redeveloping their new home and property a short way up the road. Today's a work day and included brush hogging and wood chipping. All hands were on deck. This is the first time I've ever used it too. Oh. <laughs> I'm no expert by any means. Okay. So I think all you do is just do that and then do that. <laughs> <laughs> and, and it's good to go. The bounty hunter is ready. <laughs> so you sweep it back and forth in a side to side motion. Back and forth, got it. Yep, so yep. My arm and here. so we're trying to find a water line over here. <laughs> so I think there's going to be one oh, it'll running from the house water, here. Not uh, well, we think the, the pipe. Oh, is you got there. something. Yeah, what does that mean? I don't know. Stop it where it's beeping. It could, it could just be broken, it's just... Oh. <laughs> They're sitting on a gold mine. Here, test it over that uh, faucet head, then you know it works. Let me see that shirt. Ooh. Turn around. Mm-hmm. Quality time with my sister. Yep. Making onion rings. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> is this your way of not tearing up? Yeah. It, the pain is real. Oh, that's too good. I've never used this method. <sighs> yeah, they're just, uh, you know, snowboarding goggles. <laughs> I can't. How well are these goggles working? My nose was itching. I'm not crying. She's not yet crying. Okay. Yeah. So you're saying this is a good solution. I'm saying, yeah. It works for me.
With all the hard work put in, none of the food was documented before it was devoured. Don't get run over! Unless it's a Lexus or a Porsche. No, don't get run over. No, you don't scream. Um, one more stint, I think. Oh, yeah? yeah? You're in for one more? I think so. Are you guys in? Uh, uh. yeah. <laughs> I can maybe do one more. My back is going to feel sore. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good workout. But how long sure. does he rent in this? Is it a chip? Yeah, I think he's got it for a week. A week? Yeah, so he's going to be making a hit on it tomorrow as well. Yeah. I got somebody coming over to help me for a few hours tomorrow. One more? You want to try yeah. the, you want to fire up that metal detector see what you find? Oh yeah! Let's do that. Oh, yeah. yeah! Sasha's been wanting to get into that. Detecting of metals? Mm -hmm. Hopefully precious metals. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> more worthy ones. <laughs> Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel to follow along for more adventures.